Helen, good morning. It's the day after the race. Uh, how are your legs today? Good. I feel all right. A bit <laughs> tight on the hamstrings, but uh, generally okay. Well, congratulations on your win. Um, this is the first time you've done Man vs Mountain? Yep. First time I've done it. Loved it. And what was your strategy when you went out? I was pretty relaxed. I was really looking forward to it. I just thought, oh great, and I had it all in my head, I've been up Snowden before, I didn't know exactly what was going to happen in the end, but I just thought, okay, um, I'll just run uphill um, as, as much as I can, and, um, and it seemed to work, and just descended sort of steadily, but, you know, confidently. And then I got to the end, and all the bits of jumping in the water really helped my legs. Oh really? Yeah. <laughs> and obviously you worked for Merrill, so uh, when you came to the kilometre challenge, obviously there's a bit of pressure on? Yeah, well, yeah, I mean just as much, I didn't know who else was running and I just thought I'm just gonna, so um, yeah, it, would, well, it was nice to win the kilometre but I didn't know, you know, your legs are a bit tired when you've descended five miles off the mountain, so uh, yeah, just tried as hard as I could, there were some big steps, you know, I'm only five foot or something. <laughs> <laughs> and you said you enjoyed the obstacles? Yeah, yeah I did, yeah I was surprised, I've done a lot of sort of big adventure races in all sorts of places and, and I thought oh this might be a little bit tame but actually the water jump was pretty big I just went oh yes and the water was pretty cold so uh, yeah no and um, all sorts of ducking your head under all sorts of stuff and, um, and big walls <laughs> it's just oh <laughs> so I managed I managed to get my leg over so that's all right and you came in six overall yeah 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 I've um, I started on the last wave so People started at 8, 8, 15 and 8.30, so there was quite a lot of sort of catching up to do. So there's a lot of overtaking on the mountain to do, but it went, um, yeah, seemed to just catch up and reel people in and run past them. There was a lot of people struggling at the back, so I gave them some cheering on. Well, you, you're making it sound very easy. Well, <laughs> yeah, I don't know, the uphill was pretty easy, but when you really got to bash down, it sort of, yeah. okay, and ran off. And next event for you? Uh, I'm doing three peak cyclocross at the end of the month, so that's uh, the Yorkshire three peaks on a cyclocross bike, so we'll see what happens there. It's an old classic, I haven't done it for 15 years, so I'll see if I can remember what to do. <laughs> and you said you're going to actually get out on the bike today? Uh, yeah, up the pass and down the other side. Yeah, no, um, I'm looking forward to that, just spinning the legs out a little bit. Well, congratulations, you're quite inspiring, the fact you take it all in your stride. Yeah, 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 it was good. I mean, the organisation are great. I love the great race guys. They're really, you know that nothing's going to go wrong. It's really organised and, you know, when they say they're going to get a start, they're going to start and all the timings are all right. You know, as, as a runner, you're just like, well, I hope they get these things right. And it's really hard, you know. You've got to be absolutely dialed in, especially for 900 runners or whatever there is. So, yeah, it's really admirable and they do a great job. It's, you know, it is worth every penny you pay, it's just that, you know, it feels like a little bit of the time. But to set up all those obstacles, you know, it just makes it worthwhile, it's good. Well, I've definitely, I can I feel the miles in my legs, so I've had my money's worth. Yeah, 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 that's it, it just keeps you fit and motivated. And lovely to see so many people out just doing it. You know, just even watching the last place guy come in, you know, big fella, you know, but it's totally good on him. <laughs> all the way to the end, it could have dropped out at any time, but uh, yeah, they really take part. Well, we wish you good luck with the next race, yeah. and uh, we look forward to seeing you racing again. Yeah, super. Thank Cheers, you. Thank you. Cheers.